So I always wanted to change the world. That was kind of my goal. So NEA is the largest venture fund in the world. So along comes a company that I'm covering and they say, you know what, you keep telling us about the ecosystem around our company and we're really getting sick, honestly, and because you tend to be right and you're always in front of us. So why don't you just come to work for us and you can do that for a living. Ah, one step closer to the information. Like it. And we knew mobile was the pathway to create success. So I wound up starting my next venture uh, based on that learning. And so every firm has its niche. And for us, our niche is our entrepreneurial network. Um, and being the actual entrepreneurs, we are our own network. here to the U.S. to fulfill a dream of yours because the access to these type of people and capital wasn't available to you, right? I'm giving, I'm going to give Pavel a check for 25000 okay? What's your time? Um, we don't take board seats. We don't need board seats. Uh, we will if asked, but it's not a stipulation in any deal. We will always have a formal board observer role. Uh, I'm a partner with F of Venture Capital. We have 38 million in capital under management. We have, are particularly obsessed about process improvement. My dad, uh, we had two acres of land. My dad told me to mow it, offered me $10. Um, I outsourced it to the kid down the street for five. For about the first nine months of my life in venture, it seemed like the most ridiculously easy and fun thing in the world, and I was pretty sure that I would at least have the option to be retired by now. Um, yet here I am. 